Hey everyone, welcome back to Never Fate vs. Resident Evil 4 Separate Ways, those are Ada's missions uh, For the PlayStation 4, uh, so I ended the last video uh, running into a giant monster uh, so I was not confident fighting the giant monster So let's Batman Schwip back into the, uh, back into the fray and see if we can't uh, fight a giant goddamn uh, gigante. Uh, not to be confused with Gigan, the uh, God, the enemy of Godzilla. Man, uh, I really wish those hook shot commands would come up. All right, come on, let's dodge, let's dodge, dip, 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 dodge. There we go. Let's just faint and run past them. I think I could run past this. Uh, part of me wants to see if I can kill this thing. But uh, I don't know if she, Ada has any tricks. I, it's been aeons since I've actually done this. Can I just run past him? Is that all this really takes? Kinda wanna get up there and shoot him, but... Oh well. Oh, the goddamn house again? Ugh. It's already bad enough to do with Leon. Click, click, click. Yeah, that's right. That's what you're really here for. Me sorting through my garbage inventory. I forgot something. You guys go on it. Lewis. Hey, senorita. Senorita. Smokes to go with it to make my day. Where is the sample? Okay, we skip the foreplay. As a matter of fact, <sighs> man, was Luis Serra a bad guy too? Love, baby. Sounds like fun to me. Just hurry up. Okay, lady. What do you stand on all of this? Exactly, what kind of group are you working for? There are some things in the world better off not knowing. It's just this it's umbrella, isn't it? I mean. Fine. I can take a hint. At this point in the series, how many failed freaking that old man and his religious friends? Um pharmaceutical companies are there? Like by the time we're at Resident Evil 7 or whatever. Oh, end of chapter. Yay, I am victorious. My actual hit ratio is way better. That's surprising. Among all the people involved in this, Luis Serra has the least entanglements. He works for me. He's so unentangled that he could just get anywhere he I'm needs the one to. I told the organization of his importance. I did it because I like him. His history. You know what's funny is this is just using actual in-game footage and they did not even use the better version of that. To intercept his email for help. These are just still the old the police, garbage so renders. To an old friend from college. He must have thought his friend was still alive. At any rate, that's how I managed to find him. Apparently, he's been conducting his own investigation of the cult while doing research. It is going really course. far out of her way to really explain excited. all of these weird questions I had about, about Luis, Dad, and that's must be why Sadler uh, hmm. appreciated. Yeah, oh God, damn! Right, there's a Sadler fight later on. That's gonna be a nightmare. When I told him who I was, he practically begged to be taken into custody. He needed protection. He said, I have no love for Las Plagas or this stupid cult. I want out. I just want peace and Yeah, no one again. likes this cult. I Literally no one. I don't even think people who are fans of Resident Evil 4, like me, like hardcore fans, love this cult. They just, they come out of nowhere. People whom Sadler actually trusts. Tracking him down and getting my hands on the sample shouldn't be difficult. I doubt the cult will take kindly to his escape. All right, I think I I'll think Ada, you've you've pretty much explained this like twice in a row now. Uh, and then we get the whole write out. That's interesting. Uh, exit. Save? Sure. Why the fuck not? All right, here we go. Chapter three. Let's light them up. Pow, 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 pow. 
Oh good, we skipped past like half the castle already. That's amazing. Put your hands where I can see them. Sorry, but following a Oh, now we get to see this scene in terrible resolution, but in the red dress, because in the playthrough I definitely wanted to go with uh, Leon's RPD uniform. Uh, that was very special to me. Um, because he's Leon, he's the best. Oh, and going back to, I guess, in the first video, I was like, ah, there's a lot of Luke Besson references. Um, so Luke Besson directed, wrote and directed the movie Leon, uh, which is Leon the Professional, or just the Professional, over here in America. And, uh, that's the one with, like, Natalie Portman's first acting career, and, uh, Jean Reno is a hitman named Leon, and he takes in a little girl named Matilda, and that's why when you beat the game on... If you just beat the game, I think, you get access in your second playthrough to a gun called Matilda, that's why at the start of this, separate ways, the loading screen, uh, Ada's dressed as, um... Not dressed as, but she's like sort of posed as the film poster for La Femme Nikita, so which is another Luke Besson film. Ada. Ada! Story of my life! Oh, back into the freaking dog monster fountain area? Recovering the sample. He's waiting in the castle. Get in contact with him ASAP. Understood. Understood. And US government lapdog, Leon. If you do happen to encounter him, put him out of commission. We can't <laughs> they pulled up his RPD uniform. Plans. That's hilarious. No That's on. in his... Why is that Isn't in... Umbrella is more connected than the U.S. government. They know more about what's going on in this world than our government. And his only file footage is of Leon in an RPD uniform that he wore one night. Because he woke up late. Because his, his canon is that he was out drinking... Retrieve the sample. I think I could do that. Maybe. Am I just randomly gonna be in this fucking fountain area? Where do I go? Alright, that's really unclear. Welcome! Alright, you can get her bow gun shit now. Forgot about that. Welcome. But yeah, so Leon's story is that he is late for his first day of work. Attaché case. Wow, I can't afford any of this shit. So anyway, Leon's late for his first day of work because he's out drinking late because someone broke up with him. And he's wearing the... He's the only person to get the new RPD uniform. Is that all, stranger? Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Ah, ah buy, it. buy it at a high price. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, hopefully I don't have to fight these fucking zombie dogs, because I don't want to do that. Alright, good. Just regular assholes. Regular old... Assholes. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, stage three. We're just gonna skip a stage. That sucks. You better die. You better not have zombies in your head. Uh, squids in your head. Because I don't feel like dealing with that shit. What do we got here? Ooh. Same as Leon's story. Interesting. Blah! I know I'm skipping a ton of treasure in there. Oh, the door's locked! Alright, where's the key? I actually don't even remember this sequence at all whatsoever. So, this key could be goddamn anywhere. Whoa! Those dodges! Alright, I'm gonna have to take care of this schmuck getting too close. Oh my god, Tommy! Thank you! Get that shit did. Get it done. Smile! Nope, that was me. That was my fault. My aim is just horrible this playthrough. Even though it was like 83% last time. Oh, nope. I am trying to do this quick. 
and it is costing me. Like I say, haste makes waste. And shotguns murder the shit out of things. Uh-oh. There's a fucking face hugger loose. Isn't that like the scariest scene in uh, Aliens? Where she just wakes up like she goes to take a nap with Newt under a bed because Newt is scarred for life at that point. Uh, there's really... I mean, killing her in, in Alien 3 was wrong, but it probably was the best for her because all the therapy in the world wasn't fixing her. Anyway... Um, wouldn't that be, like, isn't that like the scariest shit when she wakes up and the fucking tubes are open? And they're fucking running around the room? Oh, fuck you, dickhead. S throw a flash kick and kick your head off. Oh, man. Wow, why did I just do that? I wasn't... Oh, god damn it. Holy shit! You wanna die? Thank you... today? More of these clowns! Sick of these clowns. They're all clowns now. I mean, honestly, who likes clowns? Let's think about that shit. Like, really think about it. Have you ever met anyone that's like, fucking A, yes, clowns? That's, at, like, not a, like, sexual kink. Uh, I'm gonna need that gold bangle bracelet thing. That's cool to pick up. But yeah, really think about that one. Oh my god, this would be way easier if I had the explosive arrows. Could you guys, like, I don't know, not chant so loudly? It's actually really frustrating that I just have all these dudes chanting in my ear. If I wanted that, I'd play sports. Or, like, watch sports. Or do something sport-related. I don't know how sports works. I don't know how they work at all. Where's this fucking key? Have I missed it already? Nope, there's something this way. Hello! Good night. Dragonfly, I'll take it. Nope, nothing in there. Just a creepy dude over here. Without a head. Nope. Where the fuck is this key? Take that red herb though, I need that shit. Did these guys open the gate? How do we open this gate? I have a grappling hook, I have a Batman grappling hook, why is any of this a challenge to me? Oh, they did open it for me, god damn it. This is what you get when you don't pay attention to literally anything that goes on. Just put that in that little mistake I made over there, and boom! It's like I never made that mistake. A whole elegant perfume bottle. Oh, shit. He ran really fast. And died to, like, the simplest attack. More explosive arrows, but no actual gun to fire them with. Any more of you assholes find me? I don't think so. Man, getting these sniper bullets out the Yazoo. Yes, let's get away from these people. They suck. Oh shit. I just get a kick out of it every time I block a uh, crossbow bolt. Oh, 
Oh, that's scary. Don't have a thing in you. You could stick things in yourself on your own time. Just not, not by me. Do I have to do this goddamn thing again? Ah, oh, this guy. Alright, cool. Just blow his ankle out. He's good. So, Leon technically already did this in his plotline, huh? Hmm, can I open that? Looks like I can. But do I need to? Or should I go in here? Actually, I have to go in there. I think there's something in the bottom of that box right there. Anyway, you guys will find out next episode what happens. Uh, I'm probably going to get attacked by a berserker. I'm telling you that. It's almost certainly going to happen. Or at least get swarmed by dudes that want this beautiful woman in a red dress played by me. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Like, subscribe, do all that stuff. Bye!